Alright, we're rolling. Shalom, shalom. First and foremost, call Halayim Yahweh, Bashim Yahweh Shai, Bashim Ha Raka Kadash, Rakdam. The one is the elders and apostles, great millstone, who rule and teach well. Peace and blessings to the hopeful elect. Adam Rataza, I'm on that number. Alright. This little brother here, Shema Shawan. Shema Shawan, meaning solar like. The same name as Samson. When you break down Samson in the Paleo Hebrew, you get Shema Shawan. Alright, for new brothers wondering where the name comes from, or for anyone that really doesn't know. Alright, um, <clears throat> this guy here, Leroy Colbert, is a bodybuilder. Um, a guy that I followed years ago. You know, back when I, before I even found out about the truth, I uh, followed this guy pretty closely, his uh, his style of uh, training or whatever. Uh, but he, he's also known for having little videos and share where he talks. This guy was a bodybuilder back in like the 50s and 60s. And uh, he's dead now. I think he died in 2015, I want to say. I think I was sophomore in high school when he died, somewhere around there. And, um, you know, yeah, well, you know, he also talks about various different topics about women and, you know, other, other shit, you know, that's, that's Jake's nature, you know, he wants to talk about everything, you know, he thinks he, he understands everything, but, um, you know, he, he, it wasn't given to him, all right, you know, as, uh, the scriptures say, uh, the mysteries yeah yeah this is the book of uh, Matthew chapter 13 verse 11 you know we don't gotta I want this to be kind of quick but uh, you know the book of uh, Matthew chapter 13 verse 11 he answered said unto them because it is given unto you to know the, the mysteries of the kingdom of heaven but unto them it is not given Alright, and uh, this is going into another, you know, parable altogether, but once again, I just want to, you know, stay on topic and uh, make this a bit of a quick quick one, you know, so we're going to play a little bit of what this guy has to say, and we'll, uh, we'll break it down using scriptures, and right, not by using our own minds or philosophies. How we reject nature because we, men are the seed, women are the tree, that's the way it's made. We put out the seed, women of the tree, they nature the baby. Why is pregnant? Why is the birth of a baby not pleasurable but painful for bonding reasons? Why once a woman? Is it's because that's the way the Most High set that out, and really the real reason why women have, you know, pain is uh, when you go to Daniel chapter three. Um, I think it's Daniel chapter not. Daniel chapter 3 Genesis chapter 3 Now it's either uh, Yeah this is a book of Daniel I said Daniel I just went over uh, Daniel chapter 11 with a brother That's why I keep saying Daniel This is a book of Genesis chapter 3 Verse 16 Alright and this is the curse of the woman Alright Of uh, Eve Unto the woman he said I will greatly multiply thy sorrow in thy conception, and sorrow thou shalt bring forth children, and thy desire to be to thy husband, and he shall rule over thee. Alright. This is, uh, I thought they were talking to me, but that's a, a Chris. You asked me a question? Hold on. Oh. Yeah. Two fucking <clears throat> black ass bitches asked me some dumb shit where the fucking pawns are. They're probably gonna go to do some drugs. Hey, that's their fucking problem. And that's funny, we're just talking about women. Alright, but the Most High cursed Eve. Alright, now there were other people on the earth already. Alright, that were not the, uh, that were not Adamites. Because when you go look up uh, in, in Genesis chapter 5, the genealogies in the seed of Adam. Well, genealogy, not the seed, but... This book of Genesis chapter 5 verse 1. This is the book of the generations or the genealogy or the history of Adam. And the day that the Allahayim created man, all right, because that word God is not actually talking about the Most High. 
the Most High doesn't come in until Genesis chapter 2. Uh, that's when his dead name is revealed, when that name first comes up. But uh, in chapter 1, it's talking about something else entirely. You know, it's going into the Allahayim. Uh, they say the Elohim there, but it's really Elohim. When you uh, when you break it down, I'm gonna actually switch my location here. But yeah, when you break it down, that's where you get it. You get uh, Alahayim. You know the Alahayim, um, Yam, plural. So Allah, power, Hayim makes it plural. So instead of saying the power, the powers, okay? And those powers are going into angels. The Most High set those angels to do His will, all right, to, to create the world. But um, yeah, I got a little bit off topic, fucking brain fog. I hate when fucking assholes gotta come over here and talk to me, man. Like, leave me the fuck alone. You see, I'm fucking doing some work. I'm, I'm busy. Don't don't ask me shit. Like, I guess then again, it, you know, I'm not making excuses for these fucking people. And, um, yeah. So, <clears throat> uh, yeah, we're, uh, you were going into... You know, why, he, he's asking, well, why do women have uh, birth problems? They said, yeah, it's for bonding reasons. No, it's, it goes back to the curses, all right? The Most High cursed all women, not just Eve, all women, to have that problem. You know, all of them. Like, certain of the curses were to follow that serpent. That serpent is going to Esau, Edom. And you can prove that, you know, all throughout Revelation, the great serpent, the devil... Alright, that's the same spirit, okay? Just traveling along, went to Cain, then came back again as Esau. And Esau still around to this day. Alright. So woman is pregnant, she cannot get pregnant but once until the nine months is over. But yet nature allowed man to continue to impregnate other women. Why did nature do this? This is nature. This is not you know, he's asking, well, why did nature do that? Alright, allow a woman. To give birth one time, but man, to give birth, you know, he can make as many. See, it's kind of hard to, to understand his point, right? But what he's what he's saying is, right? We're men, right? I can I can with my seed, I can spring forth thousands of children. Just me alone, you know, just as me alone by myself. I can I my seed alone would bring forth thousands of children, and we know what the scriptures say. The numbers one and eighteen. That's one of them. There's many, there's, you know, many others that go into the seed line of your father. Okay, I could make as many Israelites as I can. You know, it doesn't matter what the woman is. And I could make thousands of Israelites. And right? I don't want to write this off. I'm in the kingdom. I'm going to go ahead and do that. Millions. They could be millions. A couple hundred thousand. It could be millions. It could be billions. It could be trillions. We don't know. I don't know. You know. But uh. This, this whole thing, the way the world works is a divine plan, all right? It's a divine plan that, you know, you can't really understand unless you, you know, the most high opens your understandings for you to understand. You're not going to get it because you can't use science and biology and try to get it. You know, it's not going to, it's not going to blend well. All right, so, you know, without further ado, here it is. It's the book of uh, Genesis chapter 1, verse 26. And Allah Hayim said, let us make man in our image after our likeness. Okay, make man in our image. Now, this isn't talking about everybody. All right, this was talking about those Adamites. All right, because Adam was created. I'm pretty sure Adam was created here. But these are like the original sons of God. All right, because when you go up um, and read in the fifth, the fifth day, um, this is the book of Genesis chapter 1 verse 21. And the Allah, yeah, is yeah, it's the book of Genesis, chapter 1, verse 21. And the Allah Hayim created great whales and every living creature that moveth. Aren't people a part of that? 
right, which the waters brought forth abundantly after their kind and every winged fowl after his kind and al Haim saw that it was good all right so this is going into people okay people were already around but the al Haim made a special people to have their image to have the law statutes and commandments okay because think about it cain cain and uh, and adam knew about you know sacrifices they knew they knew about the most high maybe they didn't know the name or they they had a, a different kind of name back then but they knew they knew what they were doing well how did uh later down the line how, how did enoch get the name like these are things you gotta you gotta think about you know these guys like these people in the world they don't get it you know unto them it is, it is not given all right i'm not sure if i broke that down i had a little bit of brain fog but you know, to them it's not given. Alright, they don't they, they can't understand it. Alright. Fucking police can't even have a peace and quiet on a given day. And those two bitches probably got this dumbasses lost. I mean they all they gotta do is go down and around. They could have went the other way too, but yeah, fuck it. I wasn't thinking of it at the moment. They kinda caught me while I was thinking of something else. I just really wanted them to get the fuck away from me. Hate fucking moment, especially on the on the new moon. Like, get the fuck away from me. All right, this is the book of Genesis, chapter one. I'm gonna go back down to verse 26. And Elohim said, "Let us make man in our image, after our likeness." All right, this is the Israelites before they were called Israelites, by the way, sons of God. And let them have dominion over the fish of the sea, and over the fowl of the air, and over the cattle, and over all the earth. And does not the scripture say in first address the world was created for our sake? Alright. These these were Israelites before they were called Israelites. Okay? That's why Adam was brought forth to you know keep him in line and to you know to to be righteous. Alright, and then Adam made his mistakes. And then it, you know, you get that chosen line after let's see here, it was Seth. After Seth came up, because Seth means compensation. And then at the Seth, you get the chosen line, you know, and that's that's also proof that there was other other nations. Cause how did, you know, how how else did the sons of God, um, you know, go off? They started to 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 breed, and uh, with the other nations, you know, they had children with the other nations, which that doesn't intermix anything. You can't intermix because it's still an Israelite, still a, a son of God, all right. But the um, when it really means that when you read that part in Genesis chapter 5 I believe you know making marriages it really means you know uh, spiritual fornication not literal fornication you can't you can't a man can't cheat the cheating doesn't exist for men now a woman can cheat and that's called adultery and she's supposed to be put to death alright but we're given power over the earth alright uh let me see here. Was it 26? Yeah. I'm, uh, and over all the earth and over the creeping, every creeping thing that creepeth upon the earth. Verse 27. So the Allah Haim created man his own image, and the image of the Allah Haim created they him, they, because it's multiple, it's plural. Male and female created they them. Verse 28. And the Allah Haim blessed him. And Allah I have said unto them, Be fruitful and multiply and replenish the earth and subdue it. Okay, replenish the earth and subdue it. All right, once again, these are the, you know, before they were called Israelites, sons of God, all right, and later called Adamites. You know, which, um, yeah, I got to go into it again. Uh, I believe Adam was created at this point. Then they were going off and Adam was made to just keep everybody in order and materialize to bring everyone in order. And uh, get everybody right again, you know. And you know, of course, Adam made his mistakes, and then boom. And if you can receive it, Adam is also Yahweh Shai, you know, which that's a whole another topic, a whole another lesson in itself. But you know, to answer this guy's question, uh, no, Leroy, uh, it's not, it's not. Uh, nature as you think of it or oh, how wide nature do it no 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 it's no nature alright it's it's the most high alright this this whole 
way you see the world it's a divine order okay even us in our in our captivity is order okay we were put down here for a reason we weren't just dropped down here and became slaves and got our asses beat so fucking bad for no reason okay there was a reason this was done unto us okay um so hey that's all i got all right Alright, that's all I got. Shalom.